Oh, did you guys see the thing about the Georgia Guidestones? Yes. Yeah, and I don't understand no, what happened. What right, it firstly, is, really. Firstly, let me tell you what the Georgia Guidestones are. Um, in Elberton, Georgia, um, which is like 40 minutes from where I grew up, um, we used to go to Elberton all the time. It's the granite capital of the world. That's their little claim to fame. Ooh, and uh, probably what those stones are made out of. It's exactly what the fucking stones are made out of. <laughs> They've been there since the 80s, and uh, basically it's this uh, redneck stone hinge down in Elberton. And uh, on it, written in, I think, English and Russian. Swahili which, and, is and Swahili is a weird pick, but also Chinese. And yeah. um, a, a few of the, the, the bigger languages are, are like these ten uh, sort of tenements, if you will, for how to rebuild the world after an apocalypse. And it's sort of built there to last through an apocalypse and hopefully like the remnants of humanity maybe read it in one of the languages that they still use. This is and, so retarded. <laughs> Okay, well, some guy thought it was a good idea, and and under a pseudonym, he had it uh, created, and no one ever knew who, who who built it. And there's this crazy lady politician in Georgia who claims that it has something to do with QAnon. Uh, I think it's p- specifically the part about the world should have 500 million population so that humanity can live in equilibrium. She claimed with our QAnon planet. told her this, I think. Yeah, she's on the that's, side okay, of QAnon. She's not battling QAnon. Yeah. Oh, interesting. Yeah, yeah. Okay. The, the 500 million thing is the only thing I've seen about the guidestones, where it was well, like keep keep humanity under half. of That's the pretty much what I remember. But I don't know anything else. So then the other night, someone. Um, showed up and i've got the security footage here uh zach i don't know if you can show that oh i haven't um, seen sure let's see oh somebody, my god i can read what that says i just what? i just saw the photo somebody of it somebody afterwards. blew up part of the georgia guidestones like 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 fighting the good fight i suppose it was just a co- look i've been there before it's a cool wow. little roadside attraction like you get out you look at it, you're like wow that really is big yeah That's she's crazy. a crazy there's a kooky republican who thinks that she's getting messages from QAnon that says that these this group of stones is a problem and she went up there talked about it in a debate and in her campaign and somebody probably not her exactly but someone inspired by her most likely broke them lame yeah did yeah. you say do you say probably not her exactly yeah <laughs> yeah, yeah. i don't know if you see her jogging out of the woods <laughs> <laughs> in a pantsuit no dude i'm i'm fine with this and okay. here's why that is one of the ugliest least impressive monuments i've ever seen you gotta see it in the daytime zach give us a daytime image of, get, show, us how, good, em, show us how embarrassing zach, and small and little zach, and stupid it is i'm feeling targeted with these insults do you know First why stonehenge all, is impressive <laughs> it's not because of the innate aesthetic it's because it's tens of thousands Josh of years old joke. yeah <laughs> It's, yes, this isn't <laughs> impressive. It doesn't look good. They did this in the 80s. Well, is it not, true that it, no, this is really hitting home? <laughs> they were, true, they were doing a, cocaine. A they were like doing, they, they had like the beginnings of the internet. And this is what they came up with. This looks like dog shit. If they're going <laughs> to rebuild it, take the whole thing down, make it look better, make it look cooler. Maybe it's something a little metallic. Make you a, show a person. You know, everyone's a critic. I don't see your monuments. I don't How see about your a statue. How about a statue? Any, anything is. Do you tell me that doesn't look incomplete and, and shitty? That thing's huge. I think it looks all right. It's terrible. It's I, I terrible. bet it's 18 Can't, feet tall. I cannot believe you guys are defending an ugly statue like that. Oh, wow. That's the Hideous. aftermath today. Hmm. Look, like, it didn't on. even make it uglier. It kind of looks that's, better. That's after they blew it up. <laughs> yes, it yeah, clearly. <laughs> oh, is this afterward? You can't tell because it's such an <laughs> eyesore either way. <laughs> you were like, it's a little smaller. It looks better. Oh, shit. Never mind. It got destroyed. And then, but don't worry. <laughs> they've got a carving there so you can see when the solstice is. The genius that made this. What are the edible plants in my region? No, bitch. Here's solstice info. <laughs> like, <laughs> If you need the big dipper, I got you, fam. Well, I, no, I that mean, sucks. I, make it, make it, make it maybe glass, metallic. Make nobody it a bigger comes thing. in here. Here picking on the St. Louis Arch for no fucking reason. That's all I'm saying. You don't. Yeah, have just because to... it looks better than anything in in your whole city. Like you can't pick on it. What do you have? Well, ugly buildings. I, I mean, I don't know. We. What's the name of that really cool Atlanta architecture? We got Six Flags. What's the name? Touche. We are on the Viper. <laughs> Masterpiece of human architecture. Clearly, Six you've Flags. never seen the Batman. <laughs> <laughs> we literally have a Batman at the Six Flags St. Louis. <laughs> They're identical. 
They're identical. They're, I guarantee the, you. they're all every Six Flags. What a disappointing road trip that would be. We're going to go to every Six Flags in America. <laughs> <laughs> it's the same thing. We're on the Batman again. <laughs> well, this time the, the Superman thing. is called the Flash. So I guess it's kind <laughs> of. So I don't think it's exactly the same thing. We've got Goliath here. I don't know if anybody else has Goliath. Is that the one that's... that falls or the one that shoots you up and then backwards? Neither. It's just a gigantic coaster. You go really high, and 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 the way you're seated is kind of traditional, but you're also more open than normal. It's a, uh, it's a really good one. Um, and I like Acrophobia. That's the one that just drops you straight down. <laughs>